Uh, so here we're implementing just a list of, um, of content that is implemented as um, of these widgets that are being rendered as an array. And we want to be able to remove one of these widgets. Yes, we want to click on this and go out to the server and, and hit a delete. Yes? All right, so to do that, here's the, the, the button. Uh, we need to decide where do we want to do that, right? Um, so uh, what, what we could do is, uh, is, uh, is, is handle all that here, right? Or you know, notify our parent, right? Because our parent has, uh, has the, 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 the routing, right? The, uh, the widget list component, notice it has a, it has a dispatcher, right? It has uh, all the state mapping and all that, right? We could, we could do that. Uh, or we could have our own mapping, right? We could have our own state, right? And our own everything, right? We can, we can, we can do that. Um, well, the way I'm going to go is that I'm going to go with my parent, right? And have the, the, the my parent handle all that, right? Uh, so what we're going to do is that we're going to pass each uh, to each one of the widgets, not only the widget itself, but some handling that we want to do up here. So for instance, you know, delete widget, we're going to pass it down. Uh, we're going to pass it down as this dot props dot delete widget, right? And that's going to be handled by this guy over here, right? We're going to have the delete, and presumably you're going to pass me the widget ID that you are removing. Right, and and this will will be handled uh, here. We'll remove the we'll remove the widget, right, and then we'll re-render the whole thing. Okay, up. Uh, all right, excellent. So, so uh, let's implement this delete widget inside of uh, the uh, widget over here. We have the button here, and uh, and this would be the on the on click, on click. We want to render who? We want to call our parent. Right, and we will call you know this dot props dot delete widget delete uh, widget, and we'll pass you the ID of the widget that we want to remove. Uh, this dot props dot widget with the jit dot, and I'll pass you the ID of the widget that we want to remove. Uh, widget, did I spell it right? Widget, yep. Which will be over here, and let's say let's make sure that we can uh, we're indeed calling this guy alert widget ID. Let's see if it works. If we click here, we're passing one two three, two three four, and three four five. So so the delete is working, right? We're passing that to the uh, uh, to these, these event handlers, right? The implementation would be to actually call the server right, and say, hey server, you know, remove this 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 widget. So let's let's do that. Let's uh, let's do a fetch. Right. Let's uh, re-implement this. Uh, this will be uh, a fetch uh, to this URL. So I'm going to copy this URL identical, right? And um, it uh, it uh, again, if I'm using RESTful APIs, the delete will be the nouns slash followed by the ID of the record that I'm trying to remove. Right, I believe we already implemented that on the server. Uh, this will come back. This will come back with a response, which is it'll be some status information that we'll probably don't care about. Or we can validate. We can say that this is a status. Notice that this does not come back with, the, uh, with an object or an array. It comes back with a 1 or 0. And, uh, and once we've done that, we can go to the reducer and say, hey, reducer, remove this from the status, right? So we can, from the, from the state, we can say dispatch and notify the reducer that there's been a, an event where we deleted a widget. And the ID of the widget that we remove is being passed to us here, WID, so that in our reducer, we can remove it from the state. We can say... Uh, if the if it was delete widget, right? What we're going to do is that we're going to return. We're going to return for the widgets, all the widgets minus state that widgets dot map uh, filter filter 
the widget whose ID, I only want the ones whose, whose ID is different from the action that widget ID that I'm passing you as an argument. So I don't want that one. I want all of them except that one. Okay, so that if we're back here and we, we, uh, we click on this, uh, so notice that we removed it from the local, from the local, if we refresh, let's see if we did remove it, we didn't remove it. Uh, looks like the server uh, did not work. Let's see why it did not work. And console, network, let's click on this delete. Okay, we did the delete, get, oh, a get, oh, so it's not get, <laughs> right, it's delete. All right, so let's fix that. And so on the component over here, the, uh, the again, the default is delete, so let's fix that. I want to use a method, instead I want to use delete. Let's try it again. And let's uh, delete this one. We came back with a status, correct. Uh, console, on caught promise, yada, yada, unexpected end of JSON input. Um, uh, did the network go? So the network went okay. It came back, oh, nothing came back. Nothing came back. That's why we tried to parse something from the server that the server didn't respond. All right, so let's, uh, let's fix that. So on the server, on the server, our delete, where's our delete? Here's our delete. Notice that we're turning void. Right, so instead of void, we'll return an integer. And uh, if we were successful, we'll just return one. Uh, obviously, uh, instead of one, you might want to return a whatever the, um, uh, the service, uh, this is filtering. Uh, if you found the element that you want to delete, you return a one. If you didn't find it, right, you would return a zero, right? Uh, so let's uh, let's be let's be um, um, let's be uh, uh, optimistic and say we did find the element and we removed it, and the controller would also respond and would return whatever the whatever the service ret returns as an integer. Okay, let's restart the server. Uh, let's refresh, and if we remove this, okay, let's refresh. Okay, we did remove it from the server and the client. Make sense? Make sense? All right. 